The game's future stars are on display as minor league baseball comes your way on the show. Tonight, game two of this three-game series between the Sacramento River Cats and the Las Vegas 51s. It's baseball. It's the show. And it comes your way next. Daffy Yellowhorse is on the mound for game two. What do you have for us on MH? Well, his last outing, Matt, he pitched into the sixth inning, but he just couldn't get out of it. Ran out of gas. I think early on he's strong in games, but in this particular ball game, what am I looking for? Can he get past the sixth and maybe carry this game through and get a W? Stepping into the box, Leading off Eric the Frederick. He'll get us started in this one Eric. under the lights. Hey, here we go now. And a fastball is hit on the ground towards short. Oh, and he can't come up with it. And they'll have no play as he reaches first base safely. Infielders are taught from the time they hold the glove that you've got to play the ball and not let the ball play you. You can see here that this one just ate him up, and he couldn't recover in time. Batting second, third baseman, Dan... And he'll step off the rubber and go to first. Just keeping him close. Get ahead of him right here. Stepping in now, Dan Yeehaw. Cortez. As he'll take a look at a strike right down the middle. It's 0-1. HR are home nine as they begin play here this evening. They've been in a nice little groove, winning three of their last four games. Hey, nobody out well, now. Matt, the other thing, I mean, they're three and two on the home stand, so they haven't been real consistent. 4-1 or even 5-0 and oh, at this point the way they've played baseball. That's why this game today puts it 4-2 and two, and now you feel a little bit better like you're playing pretty good consistent ball. Lifted in the air out to center field. I, I got it! Has a I got it. it! No yeah. runner, no runner! Cut hold, cut hold! And he will scurry back to first as he'll think twice about trying to move up. Time now to give you a look at the batting order for the visiting squad. H, what are they going to have to do to force a rubber match in this series? Matt, have you seen this guy throw? Ooh, he is electric. What do you got to do against him? I think you got to attack him early. He's just too overpowering. His stuff is electric. He's got one of those great power arms that we'll talk about for years to come. Not you got to take it to him before he takes it to you. Henry Reardon. He's set and the pitch. Henry <laughs> Reardon comes on with one gone here as he looks at a called strike one. Now the 0-1. Line drive to left. Bye. Bye. Tejeda is there to put it away, and the runner will be no forced runner, to no runner. back cut to hold, first. No runner, no runner. Cut hold, cut hold. So striding in, Brian Henry. Four. He had a couple Catherine. of hits in that ball game Brian last night. Henry. Come on now. Here we go, guys. Ready with the Steel. first pitch. Here it comes. Pitch is a cold strike. The throw. Oh, way wait. late, and he's in there easily at second. So he swipes second successfully, but you have to wonder now if that might actually end up taking the bat out of the hands of one of their better hitters. Well, that's a good point, Matt, but I'd be a little surprised if that's the case. It's still early, and the game is tied, so that would be a pretty cautious move to pitch around him here or just walk him flat out. Chop foul over towards the coaching box. The 0-2 delivery ripped down the first baseline. And a sliding attempt at first, but this sneaks by him, a base hit. The run comes across to score, and they jump ahead 1-0. Well, after losing game one of the series, to get an RBI single in the first inning of game two is a good sign. This is a tough team, mentally tough, mentally strong, ready to go. Into the box now, Rich Prescott, as he'll take a look at ball one. He takes his first cuts in this one with a man at first and two away. The 1-0 pitch. There's a swing and a drive hit well out to right field. Santana going heads back. Heads up, heads up, wall, wall. He's there to track it down, and that'll end the inning. So one run on one hit. One error in the inning, and a runner left. We'll move on to the bottom half of inning number one. 
The River Cats lead it one to nothing. Hey, come on, guys. At the plate, Kirby Suzuki. He'll Leading start things Sacramento. out in the top half of the second. Right fielder, Kirby Suzuki. First pitch coming. Here it is. Yeah. And he takes a pitch right down the middle. Pretty good pitch to hit there that he let go. I know it's early and probably wanting to run his pitch count up, but he may not get another pitch like that to swing at the rest of the game. I think he oh, yeah. held up in time, but that becomes moot as it's okay. a cold strike two. 91 mile an hour slider. Man, a lot. There's not many people that throw that Ain't one right nobody. there. That is the elite group right there. I would throw that pitch every time. Broken bat as this ball's hit on the ground. And he'll reach first as they can't make the play on him. Well, he went for the big swing and ends up getting a swinging bunt. You couldn't have rolled the ball any better. Starts off the inning. Here we go. We're off and flying. A leadoff single. So stepping in, Tyler Langley. And he is off to hey, a dreadful away. start at the Tyler plate as he has Langley. not hit the ball well at all in the month of April. The fastball oh. here is he'll take a look at ball one, one and oh. Now we'll step off and no. fire to the bag. Okay. Runner is back. Hey, infield, knock it down, make a play. The one and oh delivery. That's wide, uh -oh. two and oh. On 2-0, and oh, you can and bet oh. he's looking for a fastball that he can turn on and drive. Might be thinking about picking on that big hole between first and second. Now a snap throw to first. Hey. And a dive, but he's back in. Nobody out, runner on first. And another snap oh, throw to the hey. bag, keeping particularly close tabs on him. Ah. High fastball is in there. Frozen with a high fastball there. We'll see if they try to climb the ladder even more on the next pitch. Hit hard on the ground. Roll it up. And a sliding attempt at first, but this sneaks by him, a base hit. Now that's a swing you want to put in your memory bank. He got off to a slow start here in April, but that's something to build on. And if he can continue to move forward, we'll see him get the average up soon. Stepping in, Henry Lozano. And he's looking to make something happen here with two on and nobody out. Well, Henry early in the count, expect Lozano. him to look for a ball to drive. If he gets two strikes Come against on, him, get two he'll need to change his plan and focus on moving the runners up. This game is too close to get greedy. No outs here. From the stretch, here's the pitch. Yeah! Takes a high fastball for a strike. Well, he's got himself a little bit of a jam right here, Matt. He's got two on, nobody out. Look, I want to get a double play ball. Just pitch the contact, get the double play here. He's ready. Here's the 0-1. Tapper right back to the mound. 0-2, roll it up. And he indeed oh. takes only the out at first as the runners move to second and third with one away now. All right, here's how the home side's lining up defensively, courtesy of Majestic. Outfield play has been the key for this club, and nobody better than their left fielder. He's able to go to the corner, cut balls off, and keep away more than anything. Guys advancing the double. I love watching him play defense. Coming to the plate now, George Allen, as he'll look to bring That's home right. that tying run from George second with a base Allen. hit into the outfield. Hey, got to hold him right here. First pitch of the at-bat. Line drive to center field. That's in there. Base hit. In to score, the runner from third. And he will beat the hey. tag. Safe at the plate. Well, you think you got a good matchup. You've managed the inning pretty good. You got the pitcher at the plate. And the next thing you know, you give up a two RBI hit to the pitcher. Man, that is frustrating. Now batting. Standing in now, Eric, Eric Frederick. 
Yes, yeah. he'll take a look at a slider here that finds the zone for strike one. He comes in 0 for 1 on the day thus far after reaching on an error his first time up. One out now. And he'll snap one over to first. Oh, and he throws it away. Swing and a miss, and he's in trouble now, 0-2. I mean, these guys look more like lumberjacks than professional hitters right now. They're hacking at everything. Runner at second here with one man out. Comes Dude, back with the cut fastball for strike three ball, and there are two down. It's never a good look to strike out looking, but it's way worse when you do it with a guy in scoring position. Those are the times you really want to see a guy battle and at least put the ball in play. In now, Dan Cortez as he rips it on the ground to second. And that's by him in the right field it. for a base hit. And they're going to hold that runner at third base as even with two away, they didn't like their chances there. And two outs. Now batting. Into the box, Henry Reardon as the first pitch to him is in there for a called strike one. Hit it hard but lined out in his first at bat. Chopped foul over towards the dugout. Hey, come on now, guys. Open to send him packing. Pitch on its way. Again, he sends it out of play. Runners on first and third, two away. And a big strike out there as they'll leave a couple of runners on base. And after a good start to the inning, they can't capitalize any further. So it's two runs on four hits here. One error and two men left on base. On now to the bottom of the second. And we are all tied at three apiece. Striding in, Daffy Yellowhorse. Catcher, Daffy Yellowhorse. Oh, an ugly swing there. It's 0 and 1. Here we go now, one at a time. Oh, and he's oh, and really two. getting the better of him now. It's strike two. I think it's safe to say he wasn't ready for the fastball. Yeah, and they set him up with that curveball on the pitch before, and that one, they just blew right by him. And they could go either way now, I suppose. Swinging a soft liner, and that'll be the second out. Ready for another chance. Brian Henry will step in to lead Catherine. it off in the top of the third. Brian Henry. Into the windup and the pitch. First pitch oh. fastball off the plate there, and it's ball well. one. One and no pitch on the way. Hit hard down the right field line, but foul. that's a foul ball. And now pitch on the way. Looked like he was on that one, but it's one and two. Here he comes on a ball and two strikes. And that oh. one stayed up a little high. Two, two. Hey, nobody gone now. Into the windup. Here comes the two, two pitch. Fastball hey. got him looking as that had two seam action on it, one gone. Well, it's been a rough series for him at the plate so far. That's four strikeouts in the first two games, so this pitching staff clearly has him figured out. Center fielder number Into the 32. box now, Rich, Rich Prescott. Prescott. Swing and a liner, foul. One out, nobody on. D 
Right. Took a wave at one around one the shins now. with Point no two. luck. So back to back sliders for strikes. Does he come back with yet another? Normally not a good pitching plan to throw the same hitter the same pitch three times in a row. Bye. But Bye. both of those sliders back to back were so good. I might just go ahead and try to throw another one. Riding in once again, Kirby Suzuki. Kirby Suzuki. Here's the pitch. What? And a high strike to begin the at bat. It's 0 and 1. Well, he's really peppering the zone right there, going up in the zone. I wonder if he stays there the whole time. Usually you'll see that with two strikes, not with no strikes. The 0 and 1 delivery. Couldn't right. wait back, a swing and a miss. No that ball. is just Two a strikes. tough pitch to hit. As a hitter, you see that ball start right down the middle. You go to swing and it disappears away from you. Liner towards second. And now a jump throw against his body. Throw to first in plenty of time and the side is retired. Pretty painless half of the inning, all told. We'll head now to the home half of inning number three. And we are all tied at three apiece. Digging in to try no it again. Leading Tyler Langley. He'll try Second to get it going here to begin Tyler the fourth. Langley. Here we go, boys. First pitch coming. Here it is. Line towards center Take field. Take it. Take it. I got Bill it. I got it. Without much trouble. And the leadoff man is retired here in the fourth jumped all over that first pitch of the inning and he didn't miss it just wasn't able to steer it in a direction that resulted in a leadoff hit stepping now in now Henry Lozano Henry Lozano. as he takes a cold strike at the knees it's 0 and 1 no 0 for 1 for him here in this one One down, one down. The wind up and the 0 1. Down and away, no, ball, ball one. One one. Hey, all right, here we go now. This ball will be chopped foul. Here's the one and two delivery. And that is swung on and missed. He's down on strikes. And the first two are retired here to begin inning number four. Boy, that's really disappointing for a guy that has wheels, right? All he wants to do is get on base and take advantage of the strength of his game, which is his speed. But with the strikeout right there, you can't get on first base if you strike out. Now Standing in now, Petra. George Allen. George Allen. As he grounds one briskly to short, McDonough takes it in. Throw in time, and the side is retired. Nothing across here this half of the inning. To the bottom of inning number four we go, and we are all tied at three apiece. Stepping in and ready for another shot, Daffy Yellowhorse comes into this at bat 0 for 1 in the ball game. See it, drive it. Let's go. Right here. Oh, missed that one by a mile. It's 0 and 1. All right, one time right here. See it, drive it. Let's go right here. Pitch is way outside, and that's straight to the backstop. The throw is wild, and it gets away. And he'll make it into scoring position here with two away, as that'll be scored a wild pitch. Well, the graphic here isn't going to properly show just how far that pitch was from the strike zone. That thing wasn't even close, and I think it made the decision to move up a base pretty easy to make. One, and one ball, two, two strikes. Obviously, he wants to help himself out right here. With two strikes, that's going to be difficult to do. Let's see if he can put the ball in play. Oh, 
Come on, big dog, get your pitch. He's set, and the one-two pitch. Swung on, and he went fishing in the dirt. Henry goes to get it, and the throw to first ends the inning. So no runs on a hit here, no errors, one man left on. We've played four full, and we are all tied at three apiece. Ready once again, Eric hey, we got Frederick. No one here. He's in to get things going here Rusta. in inning number five. Eric Frederick. Here we go, guys. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. And that, that misses miss, ball one. 1-0. One -oh. Into his windup. Here comes the 1-0. -oh. And nope. he won't ball. bite at that one either. It's 2-0. Oh. Boy, he just looks locked in at the plate right now to me. His numbers in recent games have been very good, and those were two stone-cold takes right there that put himself in a great hitter's count. Too tight with that oh. one. 3-0. Three and oh. Three and well, oh. knowing the threat this guy poses if he gets on base, I think the next pitch should be a challenge pitch. You don't want to give guys that can run a free chance to cause havoc out there, especially the leadoff guy. Yeah. And a slider on the inside for strike one. Four pitches, all takes. He's showing a lot of patience here. And I like that from a guy like him, Matty. He can do a lot of damage on the base pass with his legs, so there's no reason for him to get overly aggressive if he's not getting anything to handle. No walks so far. Here's the 3-2. And I might have jinxed him as he misses there for ball four. <laughs> That is not the way he wanted to start off this half inning. It's one thing to walk the leadoff hitter, but it's even more painful when the leadoff hitter is an absolute burner and he can really wreak some havoc on the bases. Digging in once again, Dan Cortez. He's one for two in the ballgame. Cortez. Come on, fellas, let's go. Now a snap move over to first, and the runner back safely. And another snap He's throw to the bag, and the runner back. First offering on its way. There's a knee-high pitch that catches the zone. Great job of getting back in the zone with a hard fastball after the walk. I think he might have let a little frustration out with that pitch. Hey, we got no out. Now we'll step off the rubber and go to first. And he throws it away. You know, I think he tried to be even quicker with his pickoff throw over the first that time than the move he showed earlier. And when you do that, sometimes your feet and arm aren't in sync, and it causes you to throw it away just like that one. Hits are even right now at five aside. That's in there, and he's deep in the hole now, 0-2. He's in a tough spot right now, 0-2. This is one of those at-bats. You look back and you go, i got to get the man over. But now 0-2, you just got to try to make contact now. Thought That's about it, but That's he holds down. up on the knuckle curve, 1-2. and two. That's back-to-back -back breaking balls away, but now he's got himself into a little bit of a tough spot. You probably can't throw that again, so your opponent is probably up there just looking for a fastball that he can drill. The one-two pitch. Cue shot here out towards short. And there's a base hit as that gets through into left. And he's out. Got him. Beautiful throw home to cut down the run. Ready for another shot now. Henry now Reardon. He comes in 0 for 2 thus Henry far. Reardon. First delivery to him on the way. And he no, takes ball missed. one. Ball. Boy, man, I tell you, that looked like a good pitch right there. That looked no like strikes. that pitch was in the zone. He just missed it. Hey, one three, out here. Three, we got our one. score with a man on at first and one away. To third. Hey, Scoop turn up. it, turn it, turn the it. second for one. Yeah. On to That's first as they get the double play to get him out of the inning. Around the horn they go. Five to four to three to end the threat. We've got more on this Sunday night after this. 
So coming to the plate, Brian the Henry, a hit in two Catcher. tries so far. Brian Henry. Easy out, easy out, plays it first. First pitch of the inning oh. is taken low and away for a ball. One it's and one and oh. Hey, nobody on. And the pitch. Hit on the ground out to short. Scooped up on the backhand. Throw in the dirt, but a good job of staying with it that time as he's retired. Digging in. Rich Prescott. 0 for 2 on his line thus far. And yeah, we see a lefty and a right-hander start to loosen up in the bullpen. And here's a fastball called for strike one. Here we go now. Let's go. That's man, a ball. fastball Outside. just misses. It's one and one. There we Bases go. One here. One man out. Slider is in there, and now it's one and two. You know, when a guy starts to get tired, you often see their breaking stuff start to flatten out, but that's not the case here. Still has really nice finish on that slider, as we just saw. Line fouled off to the left and a few rows back. Here he comes again, one, two. And Zero. this is swung out and missed, so it's two up, two down to start the sixth inning. Really good late bite on that slider right there. The best ones have that late action that just starts at the last minute. They're so tough to get the bat on, and when you've got that good slider going, it's a great strikeout pitch. Now batting. Right here. In now, Kirby, Kirby. Suzuki. Suzuki. And a swing from him yields a foul pop out of play to the right. Some action out in the bullpen. Hey, Couple come on, of right guys. Couple starting to loosen up. Lifted in the air to center. You got Eichner it. You got it. On the move. I got it. I He's got there it. to make the play, and that'll retire the side. So they go quietly here in this half inning. Sixth, seventh, and eighth place hitters due up in the bottom of inning number six. Vegas leads it five to three. Your Phil please. Germano will get Thanks the call here as he'll hit for the pitcher. Number five, Phil Germano. Well, it's getting more and more common in baseball now these days to use a ton of pitchers to get through a game. And it took six here to get the job done. But, hey, they'll do whatever they can to get a W. And tonight's one-run game comes to an end. Six to five, the final. The 51s get the win despite three errors in the field. Daffy Yellowhorse takes the win on the mound his second of the year. Rob Kemp records the save his first of the year. So that'll just about do it. For Harold Reynolds, Dan Plezak, and our entire crew, I'm Matt Baskersian. This has been a presentation of MLB The Show. For more, don't forget to check out theshownation.com. Here now is our final line score. First, for the victorious Las Vegas 51. Six runs, nine hits, three errors, they left 10 men on base. For the River Cats, five runs, eight hits, no errors. They left 10 men on base. Time of the ball game, three hours and 27 minutes. Thanks for joining us this evening. And please drive home safely. Sloppy defensive play has drawn the attention of this player's manager.